Hello, welcome back and Merry Christmas. My pants will make sense when you see them because it is Christmas today. I hope if you celebrate, you're having a great one. Um, <laughs> I did not expect this, but my feet grew two full sizes postpartum. So one size after my first son, one size after my second son. So that was fun with all of the shoes that I have. Um, none of them fit anymore. I have a few pairs that fit. So I thought I would do a closet clean out today as sad as it is. Um, I may be a bit of a hoarder with clothes and shoes and stuff, but I know for a fact these won't fit again, sadly. So I thought I would just try them on, double check, um, and then see which ones I wanna donate or sell um, and kind of show you what shoes I used to have. If you have any suggestions for new affordable brands, or not new brands, but new shoes I can look for from affordable brands that kind of match some of these styles, some I, you'll see I do not need, um, please comment them below. I am in the market, sadly, um, sad for my wallet, but let's take a look and um, help me clear out my closet. Ugh. Here they are. These are all of the shoes that I need to get rid of, sadly. So let's take a look. That's just some of them. I feel like these are so cute and match with everything. So I'm really sad about these, but I think I got them at like H&M or Zara, so they weren't that expensive. But let me see if they still fit. See, I feel like these are not so bad. Of course, I would wear socks with them. Also, Christmas pants. Um, but they're like tight. Like I can feel like when I'm walking, it's just, they're too tight. So these are gonna have to go. These I do need a replacement of. So let's fix this. If you have any suggestions for just like comfortable black, booties like this come below have i ever literally have i ever worn these the answer is probably no but let's try them anyway like i don't need these i don't even know how to line dance so these are no but i think that they're an expensive brand maybe not durango leather eight medium if you want them <laughs> come below wait what even i Look how like torn up those are. They're like gold metallic. Pretty sure these are my sister-in-laws. Um, I feel like I like them because they're platform, but I, I don't think I'm gonna keep these even if they do fit just because they look kind of busted right now. But let's see. I like these because they were so comfortable, but um, not, yeah, I think they're just like not in good quality anymore so i'll have to say goodbye okay i don't know if you're sensing a theme but i love black and a little heel it's just so easy to match with everything these were also pretty cheap so i will be looking for something like this um i haven't tried these on since i had the baby but i'm pretty sure i already know that it's not gonna work oh my gosh yeah i can't even <laughs> i can't even uh like put my toe straight in this let's see yeah these are so tight so i do want to replace these though another so a tan pair of just wedges which come in handy a lot but <laughs> i think one of the things like the clasps um is broken anyway so might not be necessary these are cute they actually they're not too too tight And these are cute and simple and easy to like throw on, but um, since one of the clasps broke, I just feel like they're not cute enough to hold on to. Okay, I'm not even gonna put these ones on because I already know I'm not getting rid of them. Um, these are my Converse that I wore at my wedding, like after the ceremony into the reception, just so we could dance and do some bachata. And it has my last name. Nope, that's upside down. So was that. Okay, I don't know. It has my last name on the back. So I'm not getting rid of these, but they're tight. Okay, these are another one that I feel like I need to replace um, just because I've had them for so, so long. And I always thought like, oh, no one can really tell 
But just, I don't know, looking at it now, I'm like, mmm. Yeah, people can tell these don't look good. I guess when you buy cheap shoes, you can't be surprised that they don't last forever. Like, I have to be kidding. I did not wear these out, like, recently, right? Because look at that. Look at that, that looks awful, awful. Okay, I'm just gonna throw these away. <laughs> it's embarrassing. I used to be so cool. Um, these are tight as well. So I think I'm gonna get rid of my Converse. Maybe I can get some money for them at like Buffalo Exchange. Buffalo Exchange always screws me over. Let me know if you've had this, this experience, but they literally will like never take my stuff. If they do, it's one shirt for like $6 and it's, it's very depressing. Um, so I'll try it again, cause I guess I have no, <laughs> I don't know. I like to be humbled maybe, um, but if not, I'll just donate them. They're a woman's eight. And now, so I literally used to be a seven and a half, had my first baby, then I was an eight and a half, had my second baby, and now I'm a nine and a half. I feel like that's huge. Maybe not, no one really cares, but if I get my shoes in my size, I'm like, wow, like I feel like a clown, so. I'm pretty sure that these shoes are from Sheen, or Shein. Um, they're so lightweight, they weigh like, two ounces um and they actually are really comfortable to like walk around in I just don't think that like I'm gonna keep them because they're ugly so they're really comfortable but I don't think so and living in Arizona everyone has so many pairs of sandals flip-flops whatever but these have served their purpose and they show it so I think I'm just gonna throw these away as well. This whole box except for my custom um, Converse, so that's depressing. Like I said, please let me know what shoe brands I should be looking for. I know like the basic ones, I, I don't know. I want better quality obviously than like Zara, but I don't wanna spend a lot of money. I did see cute ones on sale at Aldo the other day. I should have just gotten a pair, but um, would love to hear from you guys first. And I, this is, it's just so weird to me, like that my foot grew two sizes. I was not expecting that. And if it did happen, I thought like, oh, maybe half a size and I can still squeeze in. No, fully huge foot now. So cool. Anyway, I will show you when I get some more shoes. I'm excited and I'm going to do like a ton more um, cleaning out of my closet because a lot of my clothes don't fit anymore. That's not shocking. Um, so I will take you along with that too and do like, my bathing suits, my jeans, shirts, all the stuff I'm getting rid of and donating or um, maybe trying to sell, but donating's easier. So anyway, make sure you're subscribed. Give me a like, a comment. I would definitely appreciate that. And I will see you guys in the next video.